What up, what up, what up, what up? It's your boy Ron, man. I'm back with another video. This is Trigger Reactions. Hope you guys are doing great today. And if you're new to the channel, go ahead and subscribe. Join the family. If you're not sure, go check out some of my old videos. I'm sure you'll be part of the family very, very soon. Look, guys, back with another video. Candace Owens. And, you know, that. Yeah, I know that's my girl. I rock with Candace. Uh, but uh, she's talking about a white Indiana councilman identifies as a lesbian woman of color. Wow. This, it, I don't know how this video is going to go. I didn't see it. Uh, I saw she posted it. So, of course, I wanted to react to it. I thought it would be interesting. Uh, but, yeah, let's get right into the video, and then we'll give our opinion. I love this guy. I love him so much. I'm just going to read you the headline here. White councilman in Indiana sparks outrage after proclaiming himself to be a lesbian woman of color who is, quote, living life as his true self. But angry trans local is calling for him to resign, which is shocking to me. Shocking. This isn't shocking to me because a lot of, not all, but a lot of people from that community, specifically the trans community, uh, they want you to respect their, you know, beliefs and opinions and how they see themselves. But as soon as someone does it outside of their community, even if they are jabbing at it or really mocking it or making fun of it, you never really know. People could, you don't know. But they don't like it. They don't give the same respect when people want their own wishes and to be respected in their beliefs and how they see themselves and how they identify. It's odd, isn't it? Hmm. But let's keep going. Shocking to me. I cannot wait to defend this Delaware County Councilman, Ryan Webb. I'm going to do it on my show. I'm going to do it publicly. I'm going to do it on Twitter. Because my goodness, if there is one thing I have learned from the left, it is that if you think it, it's true. If you feel it, therefore it is. There is no such thing as objective reality. So some might say, oh, here is Ryan Webb, a white man. He couldn't possibly be a black lesbian. But to those people, I would say, why do you hate so much? Why are you so bigoted? Why can't you see that love is love? And loving yourself for being a black lesbian when you're clearly not is also love. Let's take a listen to uh, some newscasters reporting on this remarkable story. A councilman is coming out as a transgender, as transgender and a woman of color. Delaware County Councilman Ryan Webb announced that he now identifies as an Indian American woman. Since that announcement, he's received some support, but a lot of backlash, many calling him childish, despicable, even calling for things like execution. In a statement Webb gave to IT Mate, he says, Why? I love it. I think it's hilarious. Uh, giving them a dose of their own medicine. And not necessarily a dose of their medicine. It's more so holding up a mirror. You know, like, if if this man clearly, I, I mean, I don't know his motives. But let's just say, if this was just to make fun of or whatever the case may be, he has that right to do so. See, I think this is the point um, that I know I've been making and others who speak about just this particular subject is, hey, you can believe and do whatever you feel the right to. There are consequences for those things, but also people could disagree with it. And I'm sure Mr. Webb, Ryan Webb, is okay with the disagreements. Like, like they've said, they reported, some people even threatened, threatened him. That's okay. You have the right to do so. That's that's perfectly fine. Uh, but let's look at that. He identifies as this and that. A female, lesbian, lover, and uh, <laughs> of color. Now, we can clearly see that this guy is a man, and he's not of color as far as of Hispanic or African descent. Right? He's clearly a white man, 
and uh, or Caucasian, however you see fit, whatever works for you. Uh, so we clearly see that. Evidence shows that. But yet he identifies as something else. Now the community that literally has to deal with this type of scrutiny is saying, hey, you can't do that. Aha. Oh. Now look at that. Everyone who's watching, please comment down below. Now look at that. And look, we're not here to hate and do any of that, but let's talk about it, right? But look at that. The people that literally deal with this every single day, and it's been their whole movement and foundation, is identifying as something else. When evidence show, and biological evidence show, that they're not that. These people are saying, he's wrong. Woo! Wow. Mmm it kind of defeats or I would say crumbles your foundation of what you stand on, people in the trans community. And again, I believe you could think and do whatever you want to do in this country. Will I agree with everything? No, that's okay. I don't have to. I'm sure people don't agree with everything I believe and do. It's just what it is. But let's finish the video, guys. Quote, it is unfortunate that I cannot simply be given the same space and respect to explore my identity that so many of those targeting me demand for themselves. It's possible I may change my mind down the road. The process of identity exploration is complex, and oftentimes at the end of our personal journey, we end right back where we started. Webb goes on to tell IT Mate this is just his true, authentic self. It is so obvious that yeah, this is his true authentic self and that there are people out there trans activists that are calling him childish and despicable I mean I have no words I have no words for that sort of hatred and bigotry and it is in particular one transgendered resident from his town named Charlize Jam Jamieson who said quote his words not only embarrass himself but you the county council this is shocking Charlize especially you as a transgendered resident you know better than ever anybody that if you feel it, therefore it is. So maybe, Charlize, you're thinking you were born a man, but you feel like a woman. Or maybe it's the opposite. Maybe you were born a woman and you feel like a man. Well, my dear Ryan Webb here was born a white male, but he feels, he feels that his soul, what he identifies with, is a black lesbian. Sorry, an Indian American lesbian. <laughs> a, a person of color and a lesbian. <clears throat> I, I'm not trying to make fun of anything. Uh, I find it, I do find it funny, uh, just the irony in all of this. I do. I mean, please, guys, leave it down in the comments. What do you guys think about this video? I'll leave the original video down below, man. Go check it out. Go support Candace Owens. Go support Mr. Webb or Mrs. Webb. Go check it out, guys. Thank you guys for supporting the channel. I love you guys. I'll see you guys in the next video. This is your boy Ron. This is Trigger Reactions. Peace.